Developed by a Japanese manufacturer, this has been called the ultimate eco car. It's powered solely by hydrogen. An onboard fuel cell converts hydrogen into electricity to drive the car's electric motor. Since it doesn't use gasoline, there are no exhaust gases. The only emissions are water. Hydrogen and oxygen react chemically to generate electricity, with the only byproduct being water. Unlike fossil fuels, this creates no carbon dioxide. Hydrogen technology holds great promise as a next generation energy source contributing to net zero emissions. You can already see it being put to practical use on the streets of Japan. Since there's no engine, there's hardly any vibration or noise, so these hydrogen powered buses are very popular. Students using their university hydrogen shuttle bus service are getting practical lessons in environmental technology. We try to educate our students to understand how science and technology can be used for the benefit of society. I believe that it's very important for them to experience practical applications, to actually come in contact with real-world examples. Until you ride one of these buses, you have no way of knowing how good they are. I think they're a very important introduction to hydrogen technology. If the use of hydrogen energy is to become widespread, refueling stations are essential. Japan now has about 160. This station is operated by a company that's been involved in the hydrogen energy business for about 80 years. They developed a liquefaction method that compresses hydrogen to one eight hundredth of its volume. Liquid hydrogen can be far more efficiently transported and stored. We are upgrading our refueling stations to handle the increasing introduction of hydrogen-powered trucks and other large commercial vehicles. There is a growing demand for refueling stations with greater space and filling capacity to handle these vehicles. Hydrogen is also making an impact on the food and beverage industry. The stove tops in this restaurant utilize hydrogen gas. This use of hydrogen for cooking is a world first. Ever since mankind created fire, we've used many kinds of fuels, from wood to charcoal, natural gas, and propane gas. But with hydrogen, for the first time, we have a method of cooking meat that doesn't emit carbon dioxide. This is a major revolution in the food industry. Because hydrogen gas is tasteless and odorless, it doesn't spoil the flavor of the food. And steam generated by the stove helps food retain moisture so it doesn't dry out. People can eat good food and at the same time play a part in protecting the environment. We hope this will inspire them to think more about environmental issues. The pace of this technological revolution continues to accelerate. Take this racing car, for example. It's totally different from conventional hydrogen cars that run on hydrogen-generated electricity. Its engine has been specially designed to run directly on hydrogen fuel. We're also starting to see hydrogen-powered passenger ships. The growing use of hydrogen energy is driving our progress towards a decarbonized world.